I just woke up. It is currently 7.30 a.m. And I'm waking up this early because I have so many things to do today. I've been procrastinating getting up for the past like 20 minutes. I need to go take a shower, get ready, and leave my house. Go to a cafe. Actually, we've been here for a while now. <laughs> we've been here for like two hours now. But we're both editing, guys. Go subscribe to our YouTube channel. She's posting a new video soon. Once we get yeah. this video finished. Yeah. It was meant for Valentine's Day. We don't talk about that. I ordered a Spanish latte. Chai with an espresso shot. Always recommend her. Now that I'm parked, thought it would be a great idea to talk to you about today's sponsorship. And I'm so excited for today's sponsor because it's with Honey. Honey is a free browser extension that helps you save money online as you shop. We've all seen at the end of your checkout, it always says, do you have any promo codes? And we're all sweating there because we don't have any promo codes, but Honey scans the internet and it finds the best code for you to use for you to save the most amount of money. If we can save a little bit while doing our shopping, you know what, even better. And they know the coupon codes to over 30,000 websites. So you're guaranteed to basically find a website wherever you're shopping. You don't even have to do anything extra. Honey will just do all the work for you. Some of the websites that they know codes to are Amazon or Alibaba or Target. All it takes is a few clicks to install. Honey has found its 17 million members over $2 billion in savings. Not only will you be saving yourself money, but you'll also be supporting my channel. As you can see, it only takes a few clicks to download. Once it's installed, you can go to a website. Here I'm on Princess Polly, and once you're at checkout, it'll scan the web to find the best code fit for you. As you can see on this pair of pants, I saved $7 just from using Honey. You guys can use the link in the description at joinhoney.com slash Fernanda to get Honey free. That's joinhoney.com slash Fernanda. Thank you so much to Honey for sponsoring this video. Thank you to you guys for supporting me and letting me work with brands like this that I've actually been using for so many years prior to doing this partnership. I just got ready, I put some makeup on. I have so much stuff that I need to do if I wanna go out later, which I am trying to do. So I think I'm gonna make some breakfast here at home right now. And then we need to do some deep cleaning because my room is an actual disaster. breakfast I'm having avocado toast the most basic breakfast that I could have had but it was the easiest thing to make as well we also have some mango which is very cutely cut out but guys I need to put you on this even though you guys probably know it but tahini oh so good this is like a Mexican spice thing it's I don't know it tastes really good and it makes everything taste better and I literally eat it on everything chicken and vegetables and fruit this on mango if you've gone to Mexico you might have tried it so good it's not too spicy I'm also eating gluten-free bread today I don't know why I'm not even gluten-free but my brother is so we always have gluten-free bread at my house <clears throat> I'm like choking I have like a chili flake stuck in my throat I'm gonna continue having my breakfast and just like watch YouTube at the same time I was just watching Hannah Malosh's Y vlogs I think I speak for everyone when we say we're all jealous and fogoing on that experience but I'm not gonna be sad about it because I'm gonna manifest that I'll be there as well okay so my room is an absolute disaster. I don't even want to show you guys because it's embarrassing. But for those people that also have their room very messy, maybe you'll feel a little bit better because you'll know that I also am a very messy person. And it's not even that I'm messy. It's just that I let it get really bad. And then I want to clean it like all at once. But then I'm like, oh, I'll just do it tomorrow. I'll just do it tomorrow. And then I don't put anything away. And then by the end of the week, I'm like... See, if I just put everything away, it wouldn't have gotten like this. But now it's terrible. But I have only like 30 minutes to clean it up. So I'm gonna put a 30 minute timer and clean as fast as I can, as much as I can. Okay, I finished cleaning my room to the best of my abilities and now it's time to get ready and I honestly don't think that I have much time. So I think what I'm gonna do is put my hair in a tight ponytail because my hair is kind of greasy right now. Ow, ow, ow. I 
I'm finally in my car. I was rushing to get in here because I was so late. I got my necklaces. I'm kind of choked. I didn't wear a longer one, but this is what we're working with right now. I've also got this shirt that is just like literally Jacob's and this brown jacket from Brandy, these cream pants from Brandy, and I'm wearing my high top black and white Converse. Some person that was like walking by, I was just like stopped on the side of the road and they're like, are you good? And I was like, I'm good. Anyways, plan for today is we're gonna go thrifting. I'm really excited. I feel like I haven't gone in so long. I'm currently waiting for Milo to come out and I'm so late. Like, why am I always late? Why? I don't know. It's 2.16 though and I was supposed to meet them at 2, which is just tragic. Oh, she looks so cute. Hey, queen. You look so cute. Thanks. We've gotten to downtown. We're gonna do some shopping. We're gonna wait in the Brandy Melville line, the extremely long lineup. So basically, we're all guaranteed to buy something. Are you guys looking for anything specific? Yeah. Close. <laughs> Maybe Close. a pair of jeans. I need, I need, oh no, yeah. I need like some big, like just pants in general. I have no pants. I'm wearing my sister's like librarian pants too. <laughs> Jackets, faux show. Sure. Uh, little no, shirts, like, baby shirts. I shirts. want colorful pants, brown trousers. I'm actually already cold. Right? I'm actually really not cold. <laughs> This is the lineup to get into Zara. It is so it is long. So <laughs> Every time we come to Zara, there's a huge lineup and we never stay because yeah, the lineup is so long. big. But today we're going to stay. It's really cold out. Walking to dinner. I think we're going to Yale Town. I'm not sure what we're gonna eat yet. Got a lot of cute stuff for spring. This table is ginormous. I'm actually confused why we got this. This is so fun. We have like a moving table, so we're gonna go around and like you guys can say your name. No, no, no. Oh. Okay, so my name is Fernanda. Had a really good day. Lots of shopping. I'm excited to eat, and I'm gonna get some drinks. Oh. My name is Maella. Went shopping. Didn't spend too much. Really proud of myself. Could have spent more, but we conserved. And I got some cute stuff. Yay. Hello, my name's Chantel. I got myself some brown sweatpants because brown is so in right now and I love it. Jeans that were $50 steal from Oakenfort, real good brand. I'm Jocelyn and you know it's a good day when I buy stuff. Just look at my bag. I'm the kind of person that never buys anything, so sit around. <laughs> Hi. My day so far has been so fun. So I'm really excited to eat. Even though I already had a crepe earlier, it's just one of those days where I can eat everything in sight. I'm just happy to be here. We got our food. This looks so good. I'm so Ooh, mussels. Those look so like aggressive. Like mussels. Like mussels. Hey. Got the avocado hummus. Can we show it? Cheers, guys. If you're eating. And I'm ready to give you a big haul. I might just even do a little fashion show and show you guys everything I got because this part is actually unsponsored. And these are things that I actually spend my own money on. We're gonna start with Brandy Melville. Kind of basic, but cute. First thing I got is just this little t-shirt. I really like the way these fit. It's like a light brown and I have a chocolate brown color one in the same fit, so I really like this. Then I got this blue sweater and it just looks like this. It looks kind of weird off to be honest, but the way that I saw it in the model, she was wearing like a white t-shirt underneath and some blue jeans and a tote bag and I thought it looked super cute so pretty cute and then I got this hat it just says New York USA I feel like this is a classic brandy looking hat I probably wouldn't have gotten it but I just want to collect more hats that are this shape and I already have a navy blue one and a brown one so I thought white would be like a fun addition oh, mm. Oh my god, I'm actually so angry. I bought two necklaces. They were both like colorful and I literally think that I forgot them both at the restaurant, probably like on the seat. Should I call them? Hi, um, I was just wondering if you guys found any like two necklaces. They were in a little pouch. I just bought them. So two necklaces, are they? They were really colorful. Has anybody found any necklaces in a bag? No. Okay, well, I'm pissed. Hopefully one of my friends has it or maybe I put it in one of their bags, but... Anyways, let's continue with the haul. Moving on to Zara, that was what we waited in line for, and you know what? It's safe to say it was a steal. I got this pair of blue jeans. They look super blue. They look like really like Levi. They're the straight full length, and I got them in a size two, so hopefully they will fit me. This is one of my favorite things that I bought, and I just think this is the cutest little like sweater, cardigan, vest situation. I feel like this is super cute for spring. Then I got this like athleisure set. It's like a top and leggings. Rosina got like a matching matcha green, same 
sage green colors. I think we're gonna take a really cute picture with it. But basically, the pants look like this, which is concerning, but I know that they're gonna be super stretchy. The top just looks like this. And then I got this green sweater. It looks a little bit washed out on camera, but it's like pastel, sage green, neon green, Easter egg green. I saw the model wearing it with like a button up white t-shirt underneath. I also went to Oakenfort and I got this necklace, silver heart, and I think it's super cute. This ugliest setting my bed isn't made i have like laundry in the corner but these jeans first of all i'm gonna be on mega sucking mode the entire time because they hardly fit me they're size two i'm still gonna wear them the other jeans that i have from zara are size four and they were a little bit loose on me so i'm hoping that when i wear these they're gonna loosen up and fit me better i think they will but i really like them so far and also i'm pretty sure i didn't tell you but they were nine dollars and then the bottoms can't really see it but they're like flared I honestly don't know if I like it. I feel like everything was just so much cuter on the models or when I was holding it up. Is this ugly? I can't even tell at this point. <laughs> I feel like this doesn't look good. And I thought it did at the time, but like, why does it look like that on me? Why does it look like that on me? It's been a few hours later. I look tragic right now. It's actually 11.42. I didn't film it, but I did a quick workout on my treadmill. I should have filmed it. Don't know why I didn't. I only did it for like 15 minutes. This is kind of a realistic night in my life because I go to sleep at like 2 every morning, probably, or like 1 or something. Like I was on a good path of going to sleep at like 12, but lately I've been sleeping a lot later. And tonight I have so much editing to do. So normally when I have my bedtime snack, I've got my milk here and I've got some cookies and I'm gonna have some milk and cookies and call it a day. I'm gonna write in my five minute journal and I'm going to look through my notions. It's like an online planner thing and I have to double check with like when my sponsorships are happening and like just get my life in check because tomorrow is gonna be a really busy day for me and I need to do all this tonight before that so that I can go to sleep peacefully and not be super stressed out about tomorrow.